So I have this email thread where I've been emailing back and forth. Now I want to reply. I'm going to click on reply. This is important. You need to reply first. And I want to ask a different question. Are you available to meet on Friday? Well, this is not about the original subject about resources for teaching. So what I want to do is next to the reply swoop, you see that there is a tiny triangle. I'm going to click on that tiny triangle and it creates a pop out menu where I can edit subject. So anytime I'm going to reply and I'm not going to be in response to the original subject, I want to edit the subject. The subject line helps the reader know what they're replying to and how to prioritize their email. Notice that it is highlighted, so I do not need to hit the delete key. It is ready for me to start typing right now. Meet on Friday. So I'm going to change it to a more meaningful subject line. And what this is going to do is create a new email conversation. I'm going to hit send. You'll notice You'll notice it is not part of the original thread. My response is not in this because by changing the subject line, I start a new email. Looking over in my sent mail, I can see that I have a new email thread that's created. It still has the original conversation, the emails down in it. However, what it's going to have is the new subject line and a new email with a new conversation to help keep it all focused.